Thank you, Carol. Ten shark attacks off the Carolina coast so far this summer, and there are many reasons for that. More on that in just a moment. I was able to speak with some folks here today in Greenville about that and the effect on their vacation plans. Now, in asking if they'll be going in the water when headed to the beach this summer, each answer I got was filled with caution, and some are prepared to completely change their plans. So, you know, right now the beach is just not like, yeah, let's do that. So, we're just rethinking it. I'm not going in there until it's safe. <laughs> Yeah, we'll, we'll probably go out in the boat and we'll see the water. I don't know that we'll get in the water. That growing up, it's always in the back of your mind. Now, as you see right there on the map, uh, the, the 10 attacks this year stretch all the way up both Carolina coasts. However, the experts still say the odds of a shark attack are around 1 in 10 million. Now, I spoke with professors in this field at both Clemson and at Greenville Tech earlier today, and both said the exact same thing. Carolina murky waters, warmer temperatures, fishermen throwing bait fish from the piers, and more people going to the beach have created the, quote, perfect storm for shark attacks.